Hey guys, it's Dino. I'll be showing you today how to make a magic memory stick. It's a 1 gigabyte. It could work with 2 gigabyte, but 4 gigabyte and above will not work. This will also work with a 16 gigabyte. What we do first is we put in the memory card into the PSP, right? Okay. Next, we go to USB connection. And it should pop up on Vista like this. Also on XP, it'll pop up something like this. You should open folder to view files. See, all these files you do not need. You basically delete all of them. Okay, it should be all empty. Wait a second. Yours should delete faster because I tried put some stuff on and I did and now it's just taking longer to delete. Okay, we just hide that. Next, we go to the files that you're supposed to download in my description. It'll look like this after you have WinRAR. I'll put a description in the video link if you don't have one. You'll download it. It'll be a free trial. Okay, there's Magic Memory Stick. You should open that up and then you'll find these three files. Highlight them and go back to the file that you just Minimize. Where is that? Memory stick. And move that window up. Drag these files that you just highlighted into your memory stick. Should copy. This will take a little bit because some big stuff. This will work for any firmware PSP, fat or slim. All you'll need is a Pandora battery. I will show you how to make one in my second video. It's almost done. Okay, it's done. You've got some files in there. Just three of them. That's okay. You just minimize that. Next, you go back and go into PSP Grader version 0.06. This will extract, and you can go ahead and close out WinRAR because you won't need anything else. Okay, something should pop up. Hold on a second. Oh, whoops. Come on. Okay, there it is. Sorry about that. Okay, close that. Wait, not yet. Okay, it's asking me to install it again. I already did, so I'm not going to. It's very easy. What When you do finish installing it, it should look something like this on your desktop. Right there, little PSV grader. Open that up. And it should pop up like this. Basically, you do not touch load, eboot, none of this, select trigger button. Basically, the only thing you have to do is find your memory stick, put it in there, make sure your PSP is connected, and press inject IPL only. Should have some scrolling green letters, and it's done. Press OK. You can go ahead and quit out of that. Now go to your PSP. Press circle to go back and into your memory card. There's that. That's basically what you'll be using to unlock your, I mean, not unlock it, but put custom firmware on your PSP. You don't, you never open that. It'll open automatically when you put in your Pandora battery. And in my second video, I'll, I'll show you how to do that. So have a good day, guys. By the way, this is my first video. So comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks.